What's up, Jess team? It's your boy, man, back again. The day after, it was a crazy night last night. Forgive me for being crazy last night on them videos. It was a, it was an emotional roller coaster to say the least, but reality has set in. I woke up this morning like, damn, Aaron Rodgers, knock on wood, could be out for the rest of the season with an MRI that can give us the worst news ever. Not even five minutes in the first quarter, Aaron Rodgers goes down. <clears throat> Reminiscent of Vinny Testaverde in 98 or 99, when we were supposed to go back to this, at least we were supposed to get back to the AFC Championship game, you know? We had big hopes. Just like this year, we had big hopes with Aaron Rodgers being a Jet. But the Jets can't catch a break. The Jets fans can't catch a break, man. And now we have to yet again depend on in, you know, unstable quarterback play from Zach Wilson. Granted, Zach looked better than last year, but he still threw bonehead. He still threw a bonehead pick. And <laughs> man, man, I just can't understand why this team cannot just have a clean break. Man, I'm not lying when I say this team is cursed. I believe Broadway Joe's sold his soul, man. <laughs> Don't know, man. It's crazy, though. It is. It's nuts. It's nuts to say that the Jets are back in this position yet again. We went all in to get a future Hall of Fame quarterback in Aaron Rodgers. And the man gets, man, bro, I hope, I hope Nathaniel Hackett understands we got a running game, man. Feed Brees the ball. Give Dalvin the ball. You know what I'm saying? Give Carter the ball, man. Now we got to game manage this shit. We got to game manage this. With Zach Wilson behind the helm, man. Going into week two against the Cowboys defense, it's going to be. You saw what the Cowboys did to the Giants. They weren't playing no games. <laughs> they demolished Danny Dodge. You see that seven sacks on his ass. So here we go, man. Reality set in. I was hyped last night. I was talking all that crazy shit. But really, though. Man, where can we go from here? We got a great defense. We let Josh Allen know that, you know, but. Oh, man, bro. I don't know if Zach's ready. I thought Zach was perfectly fine sitting on that bench with a headset. Studying Hall of Fame quarterback and Aaron Rodgers. Studying what he needs to do with footwork. Studying how he can read defenses. And yet again, he's thrown into the fire. What do y'all think is going to happen with this, man? The more I think about it, the more skeptical I become. You know, because as a Jets fan, you can't ever be positive. <laughs> God damn, man. <sighs> so I had to put this video out, man. I was hyped last night. I was talking a lot of crazy shit. And it felt good to win a game. But here we go again, y'all. Zach Wilson, yet again as a starter for the least next few weeks. And I hope to God it's not an Achilles injury with your boy Aaron, man. But uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. I just had to drop this, man. I mean, you know, uh, Whitehead did his job last night with them three picks. Ball hawking. DJ Reed was back there, man. Your boy Sauce, the boss, Gardner was back there getting it done. And we got we got a great D, man. Front line, it was attacking. You know what I mean? The whole D was clicking, but, oh, man, we got to rely on Zach. Man, we got to rely on Zach, man. Damn. It's crazy, man. This whole Now this whole situation has shifted into this. The main position we've been having struggles with for years. And yet again, here we go, man. 
But on that note, man, I'm out of here, man. Let me know what you think in the comments, please. What do y'all think is going to happen with this team going forward, man? But it's your boy signing off. And like always, J-E-T-S, Jess, 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 let's get it, baby. I'm out, man.